from Fairfield Saugatuck Suites, the Rudin Report presents Sports and Scoops. Hi, I'm Lucy Picard. And I'm Courtney Minton. And we're coming at you live from Sports and Scoops. Today, we're here with Julie and Elizabeth Middlebrook from Richfield High School. They play every sport except for curling. Wow, isn't that crazy? So, these two stellar athletes play for Richfield, and we can't pick out one sport, they just play them all. Can you ladies tell us what sports you play? Sure. Um, hi, I'm Julia Middlebrook, and I've played four years at Richard High School, soccer and basketball. Hi, I'm Elizabeth Middlebrook, and I've played four years volleyball and basketball. So, sisters, you know, on the field, what's that like, playing together on the court? Um, I think it's definitely um, interesting at times. I feel like since you live with somebody that kind of translates on the court with your chemistry, that's definitely helped. Um, there's definitely been some, I think, funny moments on the court where we've, like, give an icon to each other we shouldn't have, but it was a great time. <laughs> yeah, with our other sisters too. I think it really just helps with the chemistry. Mm -hmm. um, talk about your other sister. We know you have a younger sister, Claire. Will she be keeping a legacy of soccer and basketball for you guys? I think so, yeah. I think she's um, started up strong in her career at Richfield, and I, we hope for her to continue yeah. and have success that we okay. had. So will you ladies be playing in college? Yes, I'm going to be playing volleyball at Colby College in Maine. And I'm playing basketball at Bates College in Maine. So you two just came to play with each other. How far apart are you? Like an hour. All right. But and how's it going to be living, living, living not in the same room? Will that be very different? <laughs> Actually, no. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, it'll definitely be different. Um, I think it'll be like a good change, though. Sure. And then when we come home, we'll always be in the same room. So, <laughs> so true. <laughs> so what has been more special? What championship? I know you guys have won a few. What's been the most special one, would you say? Hmm. Definitely, well for me, um, the basketball, our basketball FCF championship, um, it was kind of our first year playing with our older sister in basketball and I think it was just like such an amazing moment and run too. Um, I think probably my junior year soccer just because, you know, we upset the number one team and I also got to win it with um, another sister of mine so that was fun. and. Um, but all the time, all the games that I've won, it's just been so memorable. It's been a great experience. Great. And how do you feel about making it to states two times? How did that feel? And <laughs> FCX two times. You know, um, I gotta say, I love probably FCX more just because it was, um, we ended with a win. But, um, <laughs> you know, states was awesome too. Definitely a learning experience, and I'll never forget that. Right? Do you think you'll maybe walk on goalie yeah. at states? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Leaving behind that legacy like, of your um I'm done with that. <laughs> so what will you miss most about Richfield High School and sports in general? You too. We <laughs> <laughs> were reading that. I love it. It's definitely my teammates. Um, and I think, you know, playing with my sisters just because you just have had so many good experiences, so many laughs on the bus rides. And, you know, after a coach gets upset with you and just those team talks, um, I'm never going to forget them. Go to Sellies. I, I don't mean to do this, but, like, especially in soccer, every single time, um, my teammate scored. I always go with the two fists. Yeah. Oh, and I just fought the jury. Yeah. 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 How about you, Liz? Um, I think I just like to get the camera to see like me in like a scream or something. <laughs> no, we see a lot of pictures like yeah. that. Maybe oh, fists up that. sometimes. Fist like, yeah. And we know you yeah. go for captains. So what did being a captain teach you? Um, I think it just kind of made me be more of a leader and taking on the responsibility. You're a role model, just not for like your peers and your grade, but just you know, the incoming freshmen and the middle school girls showing that. Um, I hope that they can do the same thing when they're my age. Even right. at home, you're a leader? <laughs> yeah, who is the boss? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Who's older? Who's yeah. more first? All right. Oh, you have it. All right. Um, go to song to get you pumped up. Um, work remix. And can you give, me a, give me a line. You guys sing the home words. You guys can <laughs> um, do a little blend together. I don't even know. She doesn't know. She doesn't know. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, sing into your microphone. Um, go for it. <laughs> it's just like all rap. Sorry, yeah, sorry, let's hear it.